channel. I'm so excited to be back. Thank you guys for tuning in. It is greatly appreciated. As always, as you can see by the title, we're back for another episode of Barbie Legacy Challenge Gen 3, and I'm super duper excited to be back. As you guys can see, we are currently in the vet clinic working, and we are excited. We're feeling very optimistic about today, and I'm just excited for us to be at the vet clinic to get some work done to gain our vet skill and to get to help more patients more fur babies so right now we're just checking this current baby's um chart because he came in with a little red nose so we're just trying to understand like what's going on with him look at him he is too cute to be sick and he is so scared he was just so stressed out so we just kind of make sure that he was at ease so right now we're going to go ahead and check his temperature and then let's go ahead and do listen to his heart. He has a glowing nose. Um, let's see. Also, guys, I also um, added another vet clinic, a vet. So this is the other veterinarian. This is her name is, let's see. Her name is Nora, and she has a level two veterinarian skill, but she's here to help. We just hired her, and then we also have, you guys know, no, Nalani, she's actually here. She's actually on cleaning duty. So hopefully with another vet and somebody else to clean, more staff will get like a better rating and maybe a quicker service. So we're gonna go ahead and take his temperature. Um, next we're gonna go ahead and um, do a quick eye exam to see if maybe that will help. But right now we're feeling very confident. Um, we able to we were able to feel the love from both of our pets off camera. And we all have our aspiration. We currently became um, companions with Oreo. So now we gotta just feel the love three more times and successfully train out four misbehaviors before we be on level four of our aspiration. But we're gonna go ahead and see what's wrong. He's getting a little uh, stressed out. So we're gonna go ahead and calm him a little bit. And I think we're gonna go ahead and maybe move him to the surgery table to see what's wrong this is my first time doing this but i'm very curious to see um what's going to happen next at the surgery table so we know he's a glowing nose rising right breathing rainbow poop so i want to move him to the surgery table to see what we can find out next something we never really done before and i'm kind of curious so we're going to go ahead and move him to the surgery table she said are you in there taking care of him? Okay, perfect. So we got, she's in there working. I love that. And then we have Miss Nalani in here cleaning. Then we got another client right here. So I'm actually going to go ahead and disallow any new customers till we get these um, taken care of. We're going to go ahead and put um, him on the surgery table. It's actually my first time using this. So I'm really intrigued to see how this works. Oh wow, they're trying to just swallow him on up. So is this going to help us figure out what's wrong? Oh well, we can do some scans. Let's go ahead and do a intestinal scan. Ooh. It's like you're kind of like checking the inside. Oh my god, I was trying to get that. So he has the advanced lava nose. So let's go ahead and refill nose thing oh that is pretty cool i have to get this picture oh my goodness this is my first time using this he, he should be good to go at look he's good as new he is good as new. oh no that's not what he needed what happened to the machine okay i think something just went wrong Okay, is he okay now? Okay, because that wasn't the same cat at first. Hopefully he's better now. Uh, we can't really answer our dad right now. Um, I'm far away you, I wouldn't do that. The bill owner, let's go ahead and um Okay. Did we help cure him? Was he fixed? Does he feel better? Call a good pet. And then we're gonna go ahead and Oh, okay. Are you good to go? Okay, that client is all done. All right, let's go ahead and check on this client because she's been here a minute. Uh, let's go ahead and greet this patient. 
I probably won't do the surgery table ever again. I just wanted to check it out to see how it was working. But we're going to go ahead and greet the next patient. Um, Miss Nalani is cleaning up, getting everything done. Okay, let's go ahead and check on pockets and see what's going on. We can actually go ahead and maybe allow new customers because we currently um, got these one taken care of. You've been in here for a while. Everything okay over here? Everything okay? Okay, I guess he's feeling better. All right, let's go ahead and see. And then let's see. We're feeling confident. We believe in me. Trust in the universe. We're going to go ahead and begin this exam <laughs> and see what's going on here. Like, hello, ma'am. Okay, I guess everything went well over there. So, we're gonna go ahead and call a good pet. And then we're gonna go ahead and exam. Let's go ahead and take his temperature. And we're gonna go ahead and examine his mouth and see where we go from there. So, let's go ahead and take his temperature and examine his mouth. Call him. Okay, glowing nose, icy fur. All right, let's see. We're gonna go ahead and let's see what happens after this. Let's do a skin and fur inspection. And then let's see if we can find anything. We might need to go ahead and calm him down. Okay, let's go ahead and soothe him. So he has the winter fest fever. Let's go ahead and give him the fixo tree and he should be all good. To go, do we need to talk to her anymore? Um, okay, she's in here, all good to go. She said, Thank you so much. So, we're gonna go ahead and greet our next patient. Do we have any more patients coming in? Yes, we do. So, that is good. All right, we're gonna go ahead and praise her for her good work because she's doing good. Let's go ahead and praise. Let's praise both of them because they've been doing a great job. Uh, can we open this up? I think there should be some treats in here. Yes, let's go ahead and put that in our inventory, I guess. Uh, we got some more clients coming. Okay, everything is going to go. Oh, this little fur baby. I, it's so good to hear that the extra effort I've been putting in is noticed. Thank you. So we're gonna go ahead and greet this next client patient. And then you can get the next, you can get him that's coming in. Miss yes, Nalani, you can go ahead and take a lunch break if you want to. Uh, let me see. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and take this next patient. Did we not greet you? Okay. Oh, we're thinking about our family member. Okay, like she took him. Okay, so we're going to wait and take somebody else. Which is good. They've both been very efficient, so that is good. It's going on 8 o'clock. We've been at the vet clinic pretty much not all day, but for a little bit. Um, let's go ahead and greet this uh, patient and see what's going on. She's about to go get me a little break, but that is okay. I'm going to go ahead and greet this patient. And then, okay, everything is going good. My uh, new vet assistant is doing great. So I'm happy to hear that. Let's go ahead and see what's wrong with this little guy. We are a little hungry. Oh, because we got to use the bathroom. Um, I don't know if I should disallow yet. We got one person coming in right there. So let's go ahead and get it crack a lacking. Let's see what's wrong with this fur baby. She said, hi. Uh -huh. She said, doctor, uh -huh. Robert's gonna take good care of you. So just come on and step on the bed. So I think we did a good thing by getting the, the second vet. But we're gonna go ahead and call a good pet. Let's go ahead and take his temperature and examine his mouth. We're gonna do that just for now. Right now we're feeling happy, new best friend, trust in the universe. Alright, so far so good. Let's do a skin. So icy fur, low temperature. Are you guys keeping these pets outside too long? Because that's what it's giving. 
is giving you guys are keeping the, these fur babies in the snow because all these pink babies are having icy everything else we're gonna go ahead and sue this pet because we don't want him to get too stressed out and then he has the frosty flu so we're gonna go ahead and give him that tree and then he should be good to go and he should be good to go on his way. And we're going to go ahead and I think we're going to go ahead and probably close down. We're going to go ahead and take this last client. We're going to go ahead and disallow any new customers. And we're going to close pretty. So we're going to go ahead and take this last. Okay, wait for it to queue out. Uh, let's go ahead and take this last patient because we don't have no more clients coming. Which is good. Uh, I don't know where Miss Nalani went, but, oh, she's right there. Okay. So, we're going to go ahead and take this next patient. She's like, well, you all good to go? She's like, hi, ma'am. How may I help you? Sabine, so, yeah, she's if you want any real? treats, we have some, you know. We're going to go ahead and treat this patient. We're hungry, but they we're feeling pretty good. Um, they're still in there working. Um, everything is going good. So we're going to go ahead and treat this little guy. Hopefully we can still use this vet table. Wait, is she leaving? Did she leave? Where did she go? Examine. Okay, I'm about to say. I thought we were examining the cat. Okay. Where's the cat go? Where'd the little cat go? You feeling okay, ma'am? Oh, she said this vet was imp amazing. This was amazing trip to the vet. Yay. Where'd the okay, here he comes. I'm about to say, where's the little cat? So we're going to go ahead and um check on this little baby, Mimi. You know, make her feel comfortable and at ease. So the ears test her ears and take her temperature and then we're gonna go ahead and get like have like a little staff meeting with our staff we reached veterinarian level seven it's the only thing grace can now craft the poop randomizer tree at the machine medicine crafting table you read that right it's a treat that makes a pet poop something else she also has unlocked a cute pet theme wall decal so we're level seven of yes, our vet skills which is absolutely amazing. And then we're going to go ahead and listen to heart. And then we could probably go ahead and do a quick eye exam. So advanced lava. We'll give him a little treat. And then he's going to be good to go. And she said, you're going to feel so much better. Yeah, you're all good to go. Okay, so he's feeling so much better. So we're going to go ahead and close up shop. Yes, we made some good profit today. We also made um, some good money. So we're going to go ahead and close up stop. It said try lowering your price markup, raising the quality of supplies or both because we raised the price a little bit. Um, try clean up your cl uh, clinic a little better and the wait time was very short wait times Satisfied and neutral. So we're gonna go ahead and use the bathroom um, And then I think that's about it. I think we're gonna go ahead and order some pizza or something because Our staff did amazing So it's okay because we'll do something another day because they probably already went home so we're going to go ahead and use the bathroom and then we're going to go ahead and head home ourselves. We got a lot of good work done. Um, let's go ahead a lock. I don't know why this joint is locked for everyone. But we're going to go ahead and do some paperwork really quickly. And then um, we're going to go ahead and uh, go home. We gotta just get a little bit of work done and we're gonna go ahead and go home. I think today was pretty successful. I'm ready for another day in the vet, but we're gonna go ahead and go home and 
I'm going to see you guys once we get there. Okay, guys, we made it home. And, of course, you know, Pierre needed some extra love and extra cuddles. But we are extremely hungry. So, I'm thinking we want to come in here and make us something really quickly, you know, get a quick meal. We're going to go ahead and get us. I was going to get us a cup of noodles, something quick, nothing that costs too much time. We're going to call down Oreo. It's like, where is my Oreo? It's like, Oreo. So we're going to go ahead and keep loving on Pierre. We're feeling confident. We're feeling good. We felt like it was a successful day at the vet clinic. Um, Oreo is like, he's like, mama, yes, mama. Oreo is so cute. But I'm right here, Mama. So we're gonna go ahead and um, uh, scratch his favorite spot and all that good stuff. And give him a big old tree. Oh, he's sleep. Okay. So we're gonna let him go to sleep. We're gonna go ahead and make us a cup of noodles because we are hungry. And I think we had some laundry that was done upstairs. Go ahead and um, put, oh, put this laundry away. But I don't know if like today was good. It is still snowing. We're still in winter. We're almost to spring, which I'm super excited about, which is perfect. Oh, look at them. They both knocked out. That is the cutest. Look at them. Oh, where's, oh, I don't know where uh, Pierre is, but look at Oreo. Oh, he sleep right there. They are just the cutest. They are so good. And they play so nicely with each other. But they're both sleep. We're going to make our cup noodles. Um, we're probably going to go probably eat. Take a shower. And we're probably going to go ahead. Oh, we might actually do a nice bath with the soaks. Let's do a nice milk, honey, and oatmeal bath after we eat. What is the quality of these noodles? Okay, they're normal, so that is good. But we're feeling good. We're just a little tired. They are y'all must have had some long days. Okay, let's go ahead. All the lights, all lights. Y'all must have had some very long days. Cause they are snoring like I don't know what. And then oh, you need some activity. Uh let's go ahead and we can play with him before we actually get in the bath. Because you want him to be okay. Then we'll go ahead and take our bath. We'll do that muscle relax and soak. Because we want to make sure that all our pets are okay. And then we're going to go ahead and um, take a bath. Okay. They like that both the um, animals are up. But that's okay. So we're going to go ahead and check on Whiskers. And we're going to go put our laundry away, of course. We're going to probably brush our teeth and then go to sleep. Surprisingly, he does not use his litter box at all, which I think is very interesting. Um, he has food. Let's go ahead and give him um, some food and put this laundry away. It's pretty late, so we can just go ahead and take a shower. And go ahead and take a shower. It says rodent playtime. Well, tidy rodent, a little playtime goes a long way. Central heating. Oh, oh, you got a little Hello. treat so you won't be so hungry. I'm going to go ahead and treat your activity. Go ahead and use the wheel. We're going to go ahead and shower. Brush our teeth and go right to sleep. Cause we do have a nice eventful day ahead of us tomorrow but yeah i'm excited to see how day two go but we're gonna go ahead and finish getting ourselves together for bed so we'll try to open up the shop a little early tomorrow so we can get more clients in we did bring down the prices a little bit because we feel like that was people were complaining about us raising the prices but I'm going to go ahead and see you guys in the AM. Okay, guys, we just woke up and we just found out that Chloe has passed away, which is so crazy. I mean, we did plan to open the vet clinic. I don't think we could open it while we're not there. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and try it and see how it does. 
I'm actually going to go ahead and um, go over to our parents' house because I cannot believe the news that we just received. So we're going to go ahead and check on our mom because we know that Chloe was her everything. So we're going to go ahead and change our outfit. And then let's go ahead. Both our babies are sleeping. So that is good. We're going to go ahead and go while they're sleeping. We'll just make sure that you are okay. Okay, you're content. Make sure these food bowls are full. And we're actually going to go ahead and um, uh, go ahead and we're going to go to our parents' house because we just cannot believe the news. Like, Chloe was just fine. She was just doing good. It's just so hard to believe that she's gone, you know? See, I know she's a animal lover, so now she has this looming fear of death. But we're going to go ahead and head over to our parents' house, and I'm going to see you guys once we get there. We're sad about the news. We're here to check on our parents, but more so our mom, because this is her, like, her pet from the very beginning. So we're going to go ahead and knock on the door. Let's come in here and uh, hug our dad. Let's go ahead and hug. Everybody seemed very, very sad. So we're gonna go ahead and hug everybody. Is her mama pregnant? Wait a minute. Mama, are you? <gasps> Y'all. 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 I am. I, I'm speechless. She's like, Dad, Mom, Levi, are you guys here? <laughs> like, hey, honey, we're upstairs, you know. She, she <laughs> said, hey, Dad. She said, I'm so sorry. He said, I know, baby. He said, Chloe lives a long, good, and healthy life. She's like, Levi. Oh, I'm good, Dorna. <laughs> but I cannot believe our mama is... Ma when... When did you have time to do this? Like what? So Levi, are you okay? He said, yeah, he said, it's just sad. He said, I was there when Chloe took her last breath and it, and it wasn't a good thing. Wait, turn these lights on right quick. You can't turn the lights on? Uh-uh. She said, oh my God. She said, we gotta have like a little more. I said, babe, aren't you supposed to be at work? She said, I couldn't work like this, you know? getting this news she said yeah i, I didn't want to call you to fix this but he said hey brother so i didn't want to call you but you know i wanted to make sure that you knew i'm trying to turn on these lights but it's not let me probably because i don't live here no more but get to mama like since when wait can we ask her a due date like what mama she said when did you she said well I've been meaning to tell you, she said, but I know you've been busy and stuff. She said, Mama, you could we just out drinking a couple like a couple weeks ago. She said, Well, I was having mark tails. She said, Hey brother. She said, Yeah, babe, we are expecting. She said, This is one way to find out that I'm gonna have a sibling. Can we ask a due date or something? Like I cannot believe this. So yeah, baby, it's true. She said, I am expecting. I cannot believe that Barbie is having a, I mean, not Barbie, Brielle. Mama, you starting all over. She said, I know. She said, I'm really excited. She said, well, congratulations, Mama. She said, I know it's a sad occasion, but congratulations. She said, thanks, baby. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe that. She said, well, I can definitely come out here and throw something on the grill really quickly. Let's go ahead and do some, um, completely forgot the vet clinic was open. Um, is it, are we making any, we ain't making no money. We about to close this bad boy down. Let's go ahead and close it. Oh, and I check back later. <laughs> so we close it. Oh, wait, was it open or closed? No, it's closed now. Okay. So we made $477. Okay. Perfect. 
She said, I'm gonna go ahead and put some on the grill. Um, she said, I'm not going to the all vet today. This is more important. We can eat outside. She said, yeah, she said, let's go ahead and get some stuff and put out his suit like a little memorial for her. So let me go ahead and get, I don't think we can even get in here because we not, we don't live here. Of course, of freaking course. So we're gonna go ahead and put this chicken on the grill. I can she said, Mama, is do you know if it's a boy or a girl? She said, I don't. She said, I wanna be surprised. I cannot believe Braille is pregnant. Like mama. You and dad was doing a nasty. Oh my goodness. So that means my uh her old room is gonna turn into a nursery. Yep. Or we could use this but this room is so small, so Wow, that is crazy. Let's go ahead and call it a meal. She said, everybody, the chicken is ready. And I wanted to do. She said, well, baby, I'm glad you came over to cook. She said, of course, any time, any freaking time. She said, I need me a drink well, on that note. Are y'all coming to eat? Okay, I think everybody coming to eat. They still got this Christmas outfits on. Y'all could change your outfit. Um, I don't even know if I gave y'all any other because I think Brielle outfits are messed up. They are. It's a whole lot of, whole lot of. Put on this. Change your outfit as well. Put on this. Everybody should have a different outfit on. But this look good. Is it excellent quality? It is. She's gonna make me my favorite drink. Awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and I guess I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I probably need to take all these Christmas decorations down, but it's okay. It's still, um, it's still, uh, what you call it? Winter. So it should be okay. <laughs> she said, Mama, I still you. cannot believe you're, I'm about to have a little sibling. <laughs> She said, I know, baby. She said, Mama. She said, ain't that funny, uh, girl. She said, Mama, it's hilarious. Hilarious. These washing machines still broke when I used to live here. <laughs> but she said, baby, go ahead and go back to work. She said, we are okay. She said, well, I guess I could go to the vet clinic for a few hours. She said, yes. You already came. You sprung this news on me. Let's go ahead and clean this up. Put this away. She said, I'm going to get going. She said, I guess I'll take a few clients. She said, um, so she said, how are you doing, Levi? He said, I'm doing good. He said, me and my, you got a new boo? She said, yeah, I do. He said, yeah. He said, okay, well. He said, I'm happy you got a new boo. She said, let me know when you want me to meet her. She said, child, we haven't even met her yet. Don't hold your breath. She said, mama, she said, let Levi be Levi. He grown. He said, I know. She said, I just want to make sure my babies, you know, have somebody that makes them happy. I can't believe I was over here a day ago and I didn't even know you were pregnant. I can't get over it. I just can't. We're about to go ahead and travel. To the vet clinic to open up for a few hours. I'm gonna see you guys once we get there. Yes. Hopefully we have some clients that come today. Oh, she tired a little bit. Oh, I know, I know, I know, I know. But we got some clients coming. I'm just want you to sit here and relax. We got some clients coming. Um, the animals are at home doing good. Uh, we just had to go over to our mom house just to make sure that she was good. We're gonna go ahead and wait for our clients to come. Oh, they're looking for vet treats. We don't have any. Like, you're all out of vet treats? She said, my animal is sick. She said, I'm sorry, ma'am. Oh, this poor little guy. Oh, okay, let's see what's going on. Uh, Put that bed down. She said, I'm going to sleep. <laughs> Girl, uh, oh my goodness. You want to take a little snooze? You got to wait a second. <laughs> you got to... Oh, wait. Okay, let's go ahead and take this client. Girl, get up. <laughs> she said, I'm tired. Okay, let's go ahead and greet this patient. Come on, girl. You got patience to greet. 
you got patience to greet. You could take a little snooze in a second. Also, I want to buy the little vacuum that maybe will help with the everything that's going on as far as I'm going to get it. I'm going to put this thing away and go ahead and get it really quick. I think that'll help a lot with the um, cleaner up the throw up and stuff. Now, um, I do, I'm going to have, um, Nalani probably craft some treats because you guys saw that the lady was actually coming in here to get some treats and we're out of treats. I feel like that would be a good money maker as well. Let's find out how to spell vacuum. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get that. Wait, why they, wait. Uh... Or my trip man. Let me see. Uh okay, I'm having a slow moment right now. <laughs> Alright, let me see. Uh I want the one. Oh, okay. I I don't know. I am trying to figure out what is under A. Oh wow. I don't, I don't see it all. Okay, we finally got one. I think this will help out a lot. This will help with like um, just auto cleaning, so Miss Nalani doesn't have to do as much, you know. And I'm gonna go ahead and start a cleaning routine. I'm gonna go ahead and ask Miss Nalani to craft. Um, Uh, craft some stuff for the table and we're gonna go ahead and um we're up to the patient we were going to take I guess we never asked him huh looks like he's leaving much oh look at this little doggy oh so cute so we're gonna go ahead and greet him and he said, the vets are here are very great with pets. Well, thank you so much, sir. You actually can go ahead and follow me this way. Why is it not working? Um, where's his dog? Don't go to sleep. Uh, let's see. Oh, she took care of him. That's why. Okay, I thought I was tripping. All right, let's greet this next patient. Levi, we cannot talk right now. I'm about to go ahead and make her happy because she's not working her best when she's unhappy like this. Let's go ahead. I think I don't know. I think she might have been here first, but let's try to get this one out the way. I'm just gonna hold off on this allow any new customers so we can get these few. Oh, somebody built a little snowman. That's too cute. All right, let's go help this little guy, and it will help her. Hopefully. Oh, she is so cute. Oh, look at her, her little outfit. That is so cute. Alright, let's go ahead and see what's going on with this little fur baby. Um, she's already a little tent. Let's go ahead and soothe her and we're gonna go ahead and take her temperature. Like you're gonna be okay. Um, we're still a little sad about the news we got today, but we're still trying to keep going and get the job done. So we're gonna go ahead and test her and her, listen to her breathing. And then after that, we wanna see what's You're next. Okay, she's all good to go, overheated. So we're gonna go ahead and give her the antifungal spray and then she should be good to go. You should be feeling better. Oh, and she's all good to go. All right, we got another client over here, Miss Apple Bottles. We're gonna go ahead and greet this patient when we can. Okay, I think that vacuum cleaner is helping. I'm gonna need you to go ahead and clean up a little bit, ma'am. Um, go ahead and clean. Then we're gonna go ahead and greet Miss Apple Bottom. Yes, thank you very much. All right, we should be almost done. We'll probably get a couple more clients in here for the day, and then we'll probably be gone after that. So we're gonna go ahead and get this client out the way. 
you should be cleaning you should definitely be cleaning <laughs> so i'm gonna go ahead and see what's wrong with this cutie pie we're feeling good um let's go ahead and see what's wrong with this little furry guy so we're gonna go ahead and um listen to his heart and we're gonna go ahead and take his temperature and go from there so he has a lot we're trying to look at wow we just got four from that that is in treatment uh maybe we gotta move him to the surgery table i'm thinking because we don't know which one to choose so we're gonna move him to the surgery table um and see what's next um, go ahead definitely and calm him. Oh, it's gonna be okay. She said, Come on, I'm gonna take good care of you. Um, right now we don't have I think we got one client out there waiting. So we're gonna go ahead and take him to the surgery table and get started. Um, let's go ahead and um see what's going on. All right, let's give him a, let's do a, uh, okay, we got three star rating. I'm happy to hear that. Give him the belly rub stimulation. And give him the preventive shot. And hopefully this should help him feel a little better. Okay, and he should be good to go. Um, okay. I think he's good to go. Okay. you like, you're good to go. We can go ahead and build the owner. I think you're all good. I think you're healed. <laughs> and so much. We are feeling a little sad, you know, seeing all these pups and everything. But you're good to go. I think you're good to go. We're going to go ahead and take a little break and just come up here and cry out for a second because we are going through it. You know, even though we have work we have to do, you know, it's still hard on us. We're going to be closing pretty soon. Look like we might just have one or two more um, people. We're going to go ahead and disallow any new customers. So we'll have a spawn on the uh, place. We'll take a look at Greek patient oh wait does it say greet patient and patiently uh, why does it say that okay let's go ahead and do that let's get ahead and greet her I think we're not going to allow any new customers to spawn yep so how might I might help you today was that rude? Um, what's going on? Is he leaving? Maybe because we stressed out a little bit. It's a lot going on. Uh, can we not cure her pet? Um, let's see. Uh... Should we dismiss them? I mean, we just got to take her. Maybe us opening the salon today wasn't a good thing to do. You know, we got three people in here who need to be seen. I'm going to go ahead and try to make her happy. Because we got people we have to get seen. So let's go ahead and greet this patient. We need to apologize to this patient. Because that was very kind of rude. We're going to go ahead and greet this patient. And just try to get through the rest of this day. Yep, accept. Alrighty, so we're gonna go ahead and um, greet this next patient. Look, my girl is working hard. We working, working, okay? We're three stars at. I don't know what you got going on, but let's see. Let's see what's going on. So let's see, um, to actually do a skin infection because you have a lot going on over here. Let's go ahead and take his temperature as well. 
and see what's going on. Okay, he has the fleas. Give him that killer spray and then he should be good to go. So this should help his fleas and he should be all good to go. I think we have one more. Can we apologize to uh, which one is hers? Let's see. I don't see any more animals. Let's see. Is this hers? Let's go ahead and, uh, greet this patient. I'm not sure which one is hers. So hopefully that one is hers. So we can get her done and out the way. I hope that's her patient. Let's see. Alrighty. So we're going to go ahead and accept. Okay, that is hers. Perfect. Okay, then maybe she'll take care of the other vet. Okay. Or maybe that's her pet. Oh, no, that's her pet. I don't know. We're going to come here and take care of this pet. And see what's going on. So, we're going to go ahead and listen to his heart. And we're going to go ahead and take his temperature. And maybe I thought we could examine his mouth if it's not too much on him. Okay, so he has rainbow poop. Let's go ahead and soothe him a little bit. Okay, so let's go ahead and give him the antifungal spray. And then he should be good to go. And then I think we have that lady. I think she might have left, so that is perfect. Um, okay, so he's all good to go. Look, she out there shoveling snow. I know that's what. Praise. Let's go ahead and praise. And we're going to go ahead and uh, we're going to go ahead and praise her. As well as praise her before we close. Oh, praise. And then we're going to go ahead and close the vet clinic. Wow, we are now three stars. That is insane. Stress level, ambiance, and quality of service is perfect i love that the stress the ambiance that's one thing but the quality of service is what we wanted and they're both very satisfied i think i'm gonna go ahead and give you a promotion i'm gonna promote her in the next one after this but so I just want to let you know that, you know, you're doing great and I'm going to pay for you to get training classes so you can move up because you've been doing great. She said, thank you so, so much. So we're going to go ahead and sit here and just look at the snow for a minute. Um, today was a busy day. I felt like everything went pretty good. We are now a three star vet clinic, which is insane. I cannot believe it. Look how much money we have in our business fund. We are still on level 7 of our vet skill. We're almost to level 8. We are on our third part of our aspiration. And we're going to end this episode. I really hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.